Today, I would like to persuade you to believe that fusion research is worth the time and money that it has thus far consumed and will foreseeably continue to consume. As a public speaker, I have been entrusted to be truthful with facts and testimony and, and in deploying them. I believe this includes presenting both sides of the proverbial coin. You see, fusion energy is something that I am very passionate about, but passion should not require an abandonment of reality. Given that a basic fusion reaction can essentially be achieved with seawater, I would love to stand here and tell you that fusion energy is going to reduce gas prices. But no one can be certain of this. It is the elite upper class that own and operate the oil companies. Given the expense of fusion research alone, which is already a multi-billion dollar and multinational effort, it will most likely be the elite upper class that implements fusion power systems. If you asked any American today if they thought gas prices were fair, would they say yes or no? If you would say no, then I ask you to think whether or not the costs of implemented fusion power would be fair. Now, this is all speculation, but they are questions that we must consider. Having an effect on gas prices implies that fusion science will exist at a compact enough level to fit a reactor in a vehicle. Given that current experiments are being conducted with lasers the size of three football stadiums, that reality is most likely on the distant horizon, meaning we will still be using petroleum fuel products for a long time to come. I thought to myself, with so much available power, as long as it is kept cheap, we could produce more food for starving nations by keeping sun lamps on over artificial gardens for longer periods of time at a reduced cost. And then another thought occurred to me. It's probably not a lack of willingness or ability to feed these people, but a lack of care from their respective governments. Fusion energy can only do good if it's allowed to. I could talk to you about how much cleaner fusion energy is to produce, about how much safer it is for man and the planet alike, <clears throat> but are these two points alone worth the cost and effort? You might consider what I'm doing right now persuasive suicide, and you would probably, probably be right, but if I'm going to stand before you and speak, there is one thing I must do, and that is be honest. Honestly, the potential power output of a fusion reaction overshadows the potential power output of a chemical reaction, like fossil fuels. Honestly, fusion reactors produce minute amounts of nuclear waste. Honestly, fusion reactors are safer to operate than existing nuclear facilities, at least at this point. Honestly, there is a lot of work left to do before this science becomes practical, and you deserve to know that. Essentially what has happened is a few people looked up at the sun and asked, what if we could do that on Earth? Then it was done on Earth, but it has not been perfected. Do you think it is worth perfecting? Do you think it would be good to have the power of the sun on Earth? In case you have forgotten or don't know, the sun works through fusion reaction. Why do I think it's worth the cost? I think it's worth the cost because fusion reactions produce low amounts of radioactive waste. I think it's worth the cost because the ability to produce such a large amount of energy may in turn advance other scientific research like space travel. I think it's worth the cost because an ever-growing population demands an ever-growing ability to produce power. Will fossil fuels be able to keep up? Are these reasons alone enough to justify the cost in time and money? Time will only tell. If you have ever turned on a light switch, you have done something that people once thought was impossible. If you have ever flown on an airplane, you have done something that people once thought was impossible. There are a lot of people who do not believe that a fusion-powered future is possible. Do you think it's possible? Do you think it's necessary? Do you think it's worth the cost? <laughs>